Hey everybody, we're back. Surf fishing New Smyrna Beach. We're gonna try to get some whiting, maybe some bluefish, and hopefully we can get a big black tip shark. So let's do it. Well, we've been here a little bit over an hour. The surf is really not too bad, but the wind's blowing 10 mile an hour and the current is really bad. She's already using a spider weight. I went ahead and put one of our old bait rigs on there so I could try to get something for bait to catch a bluefish. But it looks like it's going to be another tough day. Well, we got lucky. She caught a little whiting. She's got a two ounce spider weight on there. I put a five ounce sinker. The current just washed it right down the beach and there's no seaweed. So I'm putting on a four and a half ounce spider weight and the bluefish rig. All right, good job. Okay, I got the 8 0 gorilla hook and a four ounce spider weight. And I got a little piece of the tail section of that whiting. I got two center pieces and then the head left. I want to save those till the tide comes in in case she doesn't catch anything else. So let's see if the bluefish are out there. Wow, she's got another one. Just a tiny bit bigger than the last one. That's good because now I can put a better piece of bait on the light shark rug on that gorilla hook because I put the kind of crappy piece on there. All right, good job. Don't hook yourself. Now that she caught the second whiting, I can put a better piece on the gorilla hook. We got a decent amount of bait now. We got about three hours before high tide. We've been here about an hour and a half. The wind's blowing 10 to 12 mile an hour. And hopefully, in a couple hours, the wind's supposed to die down just a little bit, and maybe we'll get lucky. Okay, she's gonna try to fish for the bluefish with the double 4 0 rig and the little pieces of whiting. We've been here three and a half hours. So far, just the two whiting. The wind is not dying down, it's picking up. It's probably 10 to 15, and it's becoming difficult to fish because that much wind puts a 15 foot bow in your line. Here's our setup for today. My wife with her little bait rod holding it with her back to the wind so she doesn't freeze to death because it, it's blowing almost a steady 15 miles an hour now. The light shark rod's on the right with a 20 foot bow in the line and that little chunk of whiting that nothing's touching. With that shark rod sitting like that, with the line all the way down to the right with the current, a six foot black tip grabs it and goes sideways, it'll snap that graphite rod in half. So I gotta watch out for that. I'm gonna throw this little whiting head out there. And it's right at an hour before high tide. Cause if the surf comes up and creates the little river, I'll have to put this rod up and we'll have to fish with her bait rod and just hold it because this whole thing's going to turn into the platform with the water well high tide was about 15 minutes ago she missed the bluefish right at high tide it got off at the edge of the surf she thinks it was just a little one we still got another couple hours i guess but as the tide goes out the current's already really bad it's just going to get really bad and the wind is a solid 10 to 15. Well, here's the little pieces of whiting that she's using. I mean, they're smaller than I even normally use. And she's using the two ounce spider weight. Like I talked about her little rod in the other video, that thing is probably holding more than a five ounce sinker right now. So it allows these little rods to be used quite a bit. And it doesn't get tangled up as much in the cable as what you think. Now she just needs to catch some bluefish. She's been getting some bites, but just not enough to set the hook on. The meat comes in and it's not shredded up like the bluefish, so I don't know what that is. Man, it's just been windy and cold all day today. All right, I'm gonna put the second little whiting head on there. And then there's a 
about a half of the body I can use to put the little pieces for her bluefish set up. So I only got a couple more casts with this and I'll probably put this rod up unless she gets a bluefish. All right, that's the last piece of uh, our last whiting. So I'm gonna throw that out there, give it about 30 minutes and I'm putting this rod up. All right, we're wrapping it up. The current's running us out of here. Seven hours on a cold, windy day and all we got to show for it is two whiting. It is what it is. Thanks for